Come on then, love, come in. Yeah, I'll see you in a bit. I need to ask how you are. Mm. Come on. Didn't you tell me it was him? I couldn't risk it getting out. You know what your granddad's like. Hello, love. Granddad. Right. Your mum wants to have a quick chat and then I'll take you to your mate's house. What sort of chat? Have you done something wrong? No, love. You all right? Thank you for coming. I can stay if you want. OK, well, ring me if you need me. What is it? Shouldn't you be fixing Alicia's car? Lines on it, and if you can't find anything, you're going to charge her anyway. What's up with you? What can't be doing with some dozy tart whinging on about a car when I'm having my dinner? Oh, so Alicia's the problem. I thought it might be Mum. <laughs> I say dozy tart, and you think of your mum. Funny that, isn't it? Oh, for God's sake. You said yourself she's playing games. So maybe it's time you got serious. Tell her you were wrong. Tell her you want her back. No way. She's not sleeping with him. She never did. You don't know that. Yes, I do. You slept with Faye, so she's winding you up. Just tell her you're sorry and you can finish it. I can't. You want her back? Do you? Yes. So then get her back. Do whatever you have to do. What can I get you? Oh, it's all right, Diane. I'll handle these two. You can handle us. In your dreams, love. So come on, what are you up to then? Oh, it's may surprise you, but seeing as this is a pub, we thought we'd have a pint. But you're not going anywhere else. Blimey, time for cardigan and slippers, eh? Well, sometimes people just like to have a quiet one. Not me, love. Don't remember you being so boring. I think we've talked before about customer relations. Oh, don't worry about her, Diane. Two pints, then, is it? Please. Yeah, and, uh, something else. A get a crisps? A date. Smooth. I know Valentine's night didn't go too well, but that doesn't matter. So, uh, do you want to give it another go? As long as you're paying. Go on, then. <laughs> 